Okay, I've just found a way of separating the magnet and a hard drive magnet from the just regular metal piece. Um, this you find it like this in the hard drive. It's the magnet on the metal piece. And so the metal piece can sometimes get in the way. Um, I found a way. You just bend the metal piece using a couple of pairs of pliers. You could use a vice and one pair of pliers. I think it'd probably be easier. Oh, I do have a vice in there, so I could um, I could do that because I've got quite a few to do. Because I've only just discovered this method. Um, so you basically do, oh, it's hard to do it with one hand but I'll just try and get it set up. You want to try and grip one side of the metal with your pliers and have it so the, you're not like, um, you're not grabbing onto the magnet, but you're just grabbing onto the metal. I've got it like this so that um, I can pull it down like that and then um, bend it away from the magnet because it's like glued to it in place. So I could put um, the other end of the, um, of the piece of metal into a vise and then go like that and that would work. But I, on this Last one, I just held it with the with my other hand with that pair of pliers. So I'm just going to do that now. I'm trying it with the two pairs of pliers instead of using a vice this time. It seems to have worked nicely. You don't have to bend it all the way, but I've just bent it like that, and then you can just get your finger under there and lift it up, because I think that's the glue um, yeah, it's separated. Now I could just pull that off, and there's the magnet. It's all in one piece, which is very um, surprising. And now we've got some powerful magnets. These magnets are very thin, though. So they may break, but they're on their own now. So um, that's nice. I could use them for something. Um, so yeah, that's how I got separated the piece of metal from the 